Oh Sheila. I'm so glad that Maggie was able to arrange this blind date for us. Um, are you sure you're Maggie's friend Nigel? Of course, the one and only. And, if I may say so, you look quite ravishing this evening. Is that Prada you're wearing? Why yes it is. And are you an underwear model? Maggie didn't mention anything to me about that. No. Why ever would you think such a thing? Well, how were you able to get in here this evening? Isn't there a dress code? Oh, you mean how, did I get a table at such a hip hop happening joint? Easy. It just so happens, that my living companion, Pablo, works in the coat check here at the restaurant. You see he's right over there, as we speak, in the closet. He's a real specialist at neatly and efficiently hanging coats. He really knows how to reach around things, when he needs to- Oh my, is he wearing nothing but underwear too? No, no. He's sporting a high fashion undergarment, much like myself. Oh, please excuse my mistake. So do you dine here often? Well, not exactly, but I'm quite familiar with the various dishes on the menu. You see Pablo regularly brings dinner home from the restaurant. I see. So does he get employee discounts on the meals he takes home? Well, let me tell you, it's a touchy subject. Since Pablo is ineligible to legally work in this country, he's actually compensated by the restaurant with food. Sometimes, he brings home partially empty bottles of wine. That's how I was able to learn so much about wine. I actually fancy myself as something of a wine aficionado. Oh really? Oh indubitably. Take this wine for example. It's a Chardonnay Franc and it's one of my absolute favorites. Chardonnay Franc? Don't you mean Cabernet Franc? No no. I mean Chardonnay Franc. You see, because Pablo combines partial bottles together for ease of transporting the wine home, it makes for some exquisite blends. Just thinking about them makes me want to do my wine blendo twist. That's extraordinarily bizarre, and yet strangely captivating. Tell me more about this particular blend. 